In this video, we will see how we can implement the favicon icon on the Laravel website. So to do this, what we need to do, first of all, we have to open our website. So in my case, I open my own website code. So basically, this is my root directory of the project. So in the root directory of my project, I simply go to the uh, resources folder and in views folder. And basically, this is my uh, structure of the website basically these are my views of the website so basically uh, we need to open the layout file in my in my case i am using the layout file on my all the pages that's why i am opening the layout file and in the layout file this is basically the head of the website and here we need to uh, paste the favicon uh, favicon code that is responsible to show the favicon on the complete website so basically i copy the code I copy the appropriate code and simply paste it here like this and uh, basically this is the exact code we need to use so this is the link tag uh, with the relation of shortcut and basically icon and uh, in the href tag we need to specify the path of the favicon so in my case uh, the favicon is actually present on the public directory so I if I go to the public directory uh, this is a directory which is directly accessible by the uh, browser so basically we need to put the file here the favicon file here so, so in my case the favicon is basically favicon.png uh, so this is my favicon, uh, favicon file so I placed the favicon file in the public directory and link uh, it with the asset function of the blade template okay so if I save the changes here and as you can see my changes is saved now and if i open the browser as you can see right now there is no icon basically there is no favicon in my website but if i long as i reload the web page as you can see the appropriate favicon is now displayed so if i go to and view the my paste source so this is the particular tag that is responsible showing the favicon so as you can see the asset tag uh, asset tag is now uh, show me the uh, overall link of the favicon file so if i click on it then the favicon file is successfully opened so this is how we can implement the favicon on laravel based website so if you are having any question just let me know in the comment section i will be happy to help you out thank you